Texas for four minutes. The gentleman from Texas is recognized for four minutes. I thank the gentleman. I rise in support of the motion to instruct. Mr. Speaker, the American people want financial reform. They don't want a financial reform replay. Financial regulatory reform is something we can all agree that's needed. But we owe it to the taxpayers who have picked up the tab for the endless bailouts to get it right. The House and Senate bills both lead us a long way from getting it done right. Both House and the Senate bills give the government permanent authority to continue these AIG bailouts of failing firms. Both bills let the government continue to pick winners and losers by deciding which financial companies will get on the too-big-to-fail list and benefit from the government backing. As it stands right now, these bills give the very same regulators who, by the way, failed to get the job done right in the first place, more authority and more power. These bills won't really perform more re reform. They only make bailouts and government protection for future explicit and permanent, leaving ba taxpayers on the hooks uh, indefinitely. These bills reduce the choices and increase the cost of credits. At a time when small businesses all across the country are having a hard time getting credit, uh, we're going to take actions now that will reduce the ability for them and leading to fewer jobs and more unemployment in our country. Finally, these bills fail to address the two companies that have cost the taxpayers most, Freddie Mac and Freddie Mae. $175 billion to date of the taxpayers' money are already invested in these two entities, yet this bill fails to, to make any attempt at any kind of reform of these two entities. Our motion is to instruct conferees to fix the biggest problems with this bill by removing all of the new and permanent bailouts. Our motion says that financial companies that fail should be allowed to fail and that to, uh, and use the rule of bankruptcy law, not backroom deals that give some creditors more preference over others and different treatment for different creditors. Our motion says that the regulators should be held accountable, that they should not be given a free reign to pick winners and losers and decide who is, in fact, too big to fail. The taxpayers want financial regulatory system fixed, but they don't want it fixed with permanent bailouts. Support the motion to instruct to remove the bailout provisions from this bill and insist on real protections and reforms from the t for the taxpayers and the financial system in our economy. Mr. Speaker, the, the American people want reform. They don't want another replay of bailouts. Support the motion. I'll yield back my time. The gentleman from Texas yields back the balance of his time. The gentleman from Alabama reserves.